All right, I am at uh, Canoe Creek State Park. And we're gonna take a hike back and check out the abandoned limestone kilns. I have a video from a while ago of Canoe Creek State Park. Uh, but today we're just gonna, since I'm in the area, we're just gonna walk back and check out the, the kilns. So. That's the plan, ladies and gentlemen. It's a beautiful day. I'm feeling good. So I'm out wandering around, seeing what I find and seeing what I can get into. There's a bee following me. I don't know if you can hear it, but he's buzzing all around my head and around me. It's been a while since I was here. So I'm hoping I remember the trail correctly. But if you didn't watch the Canoe Creek State Park, uh, I made that a while ago. I got some of the lake. I was down there, I got some of the lake. Uh, I think I did walk back here and I, I do have the kilns on there. And I did some of the hiking trails, if I remember right, stuff like that. But I'm in this area today and I just drove right past, I was coming right past the park so I figured I would come in here and make a quick video of, of just, the, just the limestone kilns. It's a very nice park. I didn't get to hit all the trails that's in this park. Um, so I'm thinking maybe one day this summer, at some point, I might come back here and basically just hike. Just hit the trails and hike as many of the trails as I can. Just try to take a day of it and hike as many trails as I can. Because this is a nice park and I'd like to see. I, I forget what trails I hiked when I was here. To be honest with you, I don't even know. I only might maybe hiked one or two of them that I completed. I don't remember. Nice little deck right next to the creek. Nice bridge. All right, so you come across that bridge. You make a left. Basically, we're hiking the limestone trail. And it is marked with the, the red blazes. Another nice little deck you can set and relax. Have a little picnic and listen to the creek. All right, so we are at the kilns. front of them first nice another little bridge right there
All right, so here's the, if I remember right, there used to be a sign right here. Last time I was here, there was a sign that explained and told the history of these. They took the sign out. All right, anyways, we're gonna walk the front of them. That sucks, I was gonna read the sign to you. But the sign's no longer here. So I'll just put information on this place. I'll put it in the description of the video. You know the sign used to set like right here? All right, so we'll walk, we'll walk the front. Give you a nice, nice view of them. I went up that trail last time I was here and up through the woods there. And then a the trail goes that way. Huh. I don't understand why they took that sign out. Given the history and explaining. All right. So, here is the limestone kilns. And I guess over on this side, on that mountain somewhere, is where they used to mine the limestone to bring down here to these kilns when they was working the kilns. So somewhere over there on that mountain, I think there's a trail that you can hike to it. It'll show a place where they mined and on this side the mountain there is a bigger place where they mined the rocks for this kiln and there's actually another location with smaller kilns somewhere in this mountain i haven't been to them but maybe one day all right so here's the back view again my videos I'm sorry they're so long, but you know how I am. I, I like to get everything. I like to show you everything. I don't like making five minute videos. I know most people watch five minutes of a video and then they shut it off because of their attention span, but uh, some people like longer videos. And you know what I mean? And some people can't get out to do this. So that's why I try to make the videos longer. So that's pretty neat. Inside of another one. course they're all the they're all the same walk out to the front now and do the last three Yeah, one of these days, I don't have time today, but one of these days I want to come back and I want to hike some of these trails, more of the trails. And I actually want to hike back this mountain further and find where they mine the rocks to bring down to the kilns here. And uh, try to find those other, the other ones. They're smaller and in the woods somewhere. See, there's Morris Hill Trail. It comes down out of here and it goes up that way. But we're gonna go up on top now of the, uh, 
on top of these. Give you a, a bird's eye view of the top of them. Just walk you down the line of them from the top. Yeah, that's kind of weird that they took the sign out that was in front of these, given the history and explaining everything. But like I said, I'll put I'll put the info and stuff, some of the info and stuff about them. I'll put them in the I'll put it in the description of the video. All right, guys, so that was the uh, the limestone kilns in Canoe Creek State Park. Um, wish I could have read the sign for you that used to set over there, but I don't know why they took it out, but they did. But uh, pretty cool place. I was driving right past here, so I figured I would stop and hike back here and show you these guys these. So... I hope you uh, enjoyed it and got a nice little creek right here. Nice little bridge. There's a view down the creek. There's a view up the creek. All right, guys. So this wraps this little video up. Uh, thanks for coming along. Hope you enjoyed the video and the little walk around. And as always, I will catch you on the next one.